My Bombatic BDI 631 dishwasher won't start. There is a couple of inches of dirty water in the bottom. Power works, but if I select a program and start it, it does nothing, totally silent, no pump slash water, for 5 minutes before beeping and flashing the economy light. The manual says this is drainage related, drain too high, blocked, etc., but it's definitely clear and installed properly. Any idea where to start looking? Hi. Okay what you may find here is it's either a blocked pump or faulty pump. What you need to do is pull the dishwasher out and remove the right hand side panel. From there you will see the drain pump at the bottom. It will have the gray drain hose going to the top of it. Scoop out all the water inside the dishwasher and then you can remove the pump from the bottom. With the pump out check it and see if there is anything blocked up in there. The pump impeller should ping round in stages. If the pump is all clear and it's still not running then it's possibly a faulty drain pump here which will need to be replaced. But check it out and see what you find as most of the time when it does this it's just a blocked pump. If you need any more info just get back to me. Regards. With the right hand panel off I can't easily see what I'm looking at. The gray hose connects to the drain at the bottom of the tub via what looks like a gray solenoid slash valve of some description. On the other side is what appears to be a pump, but it's connected to several things via different pipes coming from where I imagine the impeller is, a, the drain at the bottom of the tub, b, what looks like the heating element, and c, the sprayer at the bottom of the tub. Although I've cleared most of the water out, there's still some kicking around in the system. I've tried siphoning it from the drain pipe to no avail. How do I go getting rid of it so I can remove the pump without getting water everywhere? There's a pic here, slash fo1.justanswer.com slash ref slash http underscore i.inger.com slash k1teb.jpg. Hi. That gray solenoid you say is the drain pump. If you look at it you will see two screws there one top and one bottom. Remove them then you need to twist the pump off. As to getting the rest of the water out just use a sponge to clear it. Regards. Can't seem to get the thing out. Looks like there are clips in the corners, top and bottom left in the pick above, but I can't prize them up. They look like I need to turn the pump to disengage them, but it's not budging. Sure it's just those two screws, and not something else preventing it coming out. Hi yep it should be just these screws. Have a look and see if there's a tab on there which you need to bend out to allow the pump to twist off the sump unit. Regards If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash y-t-h-i